Hello everybody, I wanted to tell you a little bit about a product that I am uh, starting to work on. This just started out as a fun product uh, that I wanted to start building. Um, long ago I had people asking me, you know, when I was uh, the owner uh, of Atomic Fusion, if I could implement in some sort of uh, tracking of uh, developer deployments from Bubble. So, um, I figured I'd just throw some time at it and see if I could build something that uh, would allow developers, uh, bubble developers to do so. Um, so that's where I came up with Deploy Live, which you see here. And I wanted to just walk through it real quick, kind of tell you what it is, what it does, how it works. Um, so far, what I have built, I built this over the weekend. When you deploy from your bubble project, um, what it does is it captures some information, some dynamic information, and then allows you to input some manual information. And I'll show you how that works. And then it takes that data and it sends it to the Deploy Live platform. And then it tracks all your deployments. Uh, some, some of you call it commits or deployments, but very similar to what um, GitHub does. They track all of your commits and pull requests and things like that. Uh, this is a little more uh, rudimentary, but uh, basically, you can see here that I've had seven deploys in May, you know, three deploys in uh, April, uh, things of that nature. So this is specific to Bubble. Um, and then here's all the information that we're capturing so far. Uh, we're still working on capturing the developer that's logged into the Bubble editor. Uh, that should be done today. But this is a great little tool uh, for solo developers, also for teams to track who's deploying what. Um, to look at some release notes, also looking at maybe doing some web hooks and things of that nature. So when a developer deploys, they you can subscribe to a web hook and say, hey, let's when this developer deploys, I want to send that to a Slack channel or I want to get an email notification or something like that. So really great for small teams or agencies or anything like that. Um, also looking at uh, doing a partnership to maybe add in some change log type stuff and feedback type stuff. So kind of an all encompassing platform to uh, handle all this kind of behind the scenes uh, development stuff in Bubble and make you a little more efficient. So you're seeing here the dashboard now. Um, let's go ahead and walk through the process real quick. Um, so let's say you had just made a change to a header and you want to deploy that, that update to your live version. You would just come here to just like you normally would, go to development, deploy current version of live, pop up the deployment message. As you can see, there is a new field that I've added here for developer release notes. I'll probably be adding some more fields in here as well. Uh, and then you got your typical description. I will be changing this probably to title slash description. So let's just put um, like general um, UI update as the title description. And then the developer could type in, uh, I changed the header logo and alignment. We need to fix responsiveness. That. And then, okay, so right now when you hit deploy, it's going to send a payload over to the Deploy Live platform, capture some information. I'm working on sending the current uh, developer that's logged into the editor to send that dynamically where it cannot be modified. It's stamped. Uh, it, that'll be a great feature for developers, a team of developers to know who deployed what and when. Uh, it also send a date timestamp as well, so you know when that happens. So let's hit deploy, and that is getting sent over, and it deployed your update to live. And if we go look in the console, you can see here it takes the app name, which is the app ID that you're deploying from. Here's the uh, ID of the application. And then it put in the title description, general that I just typed in, and then the release notes, and then date time stamped it. And then over here, I'm working on that today to send that developer that's logged into the console. Uh, it does have multi-project support. So if you switch between projects, if you added a, a new pro a couple projects in here, you can track them all in one, uh, one interface. So you can kind of just jump between those. Um, I'll be adding, obviously, more metrics, 
more uh, visibility, drill downs to the tabular data, things of that nature. So that's kind of what Deploy Live is. It'll be hands enhanced uh, as I go. Um, just started out as a fun project I was goofing around with to see if I could get to work and seems like there's some people out there, uh, bubble developers that are interested in something like this. Um, so I'll probably continue to iterate on it and see where I can take it. So hopefully you guys like it. I hope you'll uh, check in for updates. I'm posting a lot of stuff to Twitter at the moment. Uh, and yeah, we'll see where it goes. Appreciate you guys.